So I thought I'd do a picture of uh, the bow truckle called Picket from Fantastic Beasts. It's great to see it's coming back for a second time. The first movie was amazing. So if you haven't seen it, I would thoroughly recommend it, especially if you love Harry Potter. So I've done, I copied a picture from the internet just in pencil and I'm just going over it with a drawing pen. It's a uh, number zero. I'll put a link in the description to the, the pens I've used and paper and also the watercolors. But I've just I'm just doing a quick outline. I've skipped some of the bits so it's not too boring for you. And I must admit the quality of the recording is not so great, so it's something I'm going to work on for the next one. I'm not forgetting to add the little wispy bits off him. him some character. Now I know some people don't like, they don't mind leaving the lines in, but I like to rub out all the pencil, gives it a nice clean finish. So here I'm just adding a very pale greeny yellow. In fact, it was a bit too pale, so I added some more. That's one of my problems is that I, I don't put color on dark enough. So there we go, add a bit more dark, a bit of yellow as well. He is such a sweet little character. <laughs> bits you can always make lighter by just adding a little bit of water to your paint. sources. It's quite a tricky, tricky area trying to know where your highlights and shadows need to go. Sometimes I need to go back in and add a bit more dark, a bit more detail. And here I've added a little brown. I'm just following the picture really, just seeing where the darker bits are. So you can blend it in just with a little bit of water. Blend the colours in nicely. Okay, I've added a little bit of grey to the, the green mix to darken the shadows a little bit. And then finally I've gone over, that's a drawing pin number three. Just where the shadows and darker bits should be. Stand. 
find out a little bit more. Give them a bit of definition. Last but not least, a bit of shading underneath. So he's got a bit of a shadow and he's not floating in thin air. So that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time.